200 people in Woodridge are included in those numbers. That is where a tornado touched down overnight. Judy Wang is there live with a look at the damage. Good morning, Judy. Good morning. Uh, I am near an intersection of Woodridge Drive and John Quill Lane. Uh, there is just devastation everywhere here. This is one of the uh, subdivisions hit especially hard here in Woodridge. It is dark. It is hard to see when you're driving and you're walking around. You really have to be careful because there are power lines down and uh, it is just a very dangerous situation. Now what you're about to see is a combination, I believe, of uh, our video video that uh, viewers uh, sent in to us and also some still photos that were sent in to us. Uh, it is believed that a tornado came through this area at approximately 1130 last night. The sirens went off approximately 25 to 30 minutes earlier. It appears that the uh, tornado hit east of Route 53 between 8030 and 75. Uh, it is believed that that tornado traveled east to Lamont Road. Uh, as I mentioned, uh, where we are, there is just debris everywhere. Trees, uprooted roofs, parts of houses torn off. There's also a lot of cars uh, that were parked outside that have a lot of damage. I've also seen a lot of residents uh, walking around, uh, some holding their pets and their carriers. They seem to be in a daze, and I don't think it's quite sunk in exactly what has happened to them. Uh, here's some uh, some accounts, first-hand accounts from uh, some of the residents of this area. 11, 11 7 p.m. Storm came through. I heard a lot of noise. We all ran in the basement and. Uh, came out to see all the destruction. Across the street, there's looks like three or four houses with their roofs totally blown off. Our neighbor's house, um, his roof was blown off. The other neighbor, their windows were blown out. Um, a lot of cars seem to be damaged too, large trees down. And we are back here live uh, near Woodridge Drive and John Quill Lane. Here's another uh, look at some of the damage up and down this street. And there, this is just one street there. If you just walk up and down Woodridge Drive, there's a lot of streets in this kind of condition. You can see uh, these huge trees uprooted, topped over, uh, damage on the houses, a car right there. I don't know if it's dark and uh, too dark, but you can't see. But there's a uh, part of the roof of the building you're looking at. Uh, is gone at this point. Uh, Woodridge officials report no major injuries at this point, but they say that they are trying to assess the situation, something kind of difficult to do uh, in the dark here. The lights that you see here are lights that the emergency officials have put up throughout this subdivision. So uh, power out, debris everywhere, power lines uh, all over the roads and the sidewalks here, just not a very good situation. Uh, we hope to get an update later this morning um, from Woodridge officials in daylight. I think they will get a better look at what they're dealing with here. In Woodridge, Judy Wang, WGN News.